What's going on YouTube? It's me, it's a comic book preacher coming back at you with some more content. I know it has been a while. Uh, just life's gotten in the way. I've been working on my dissertation. Uh, really been cranking that out. I had to finally turn that in uh, about a week ago. And uh, so I'm glad to have that albatross off my head. That was just the first draft. Uh, there's definitely going to be more coming soon. I've got a couple more years of this. So that's uh it is what it is but hopefully i'll be able to to get back in uh here after christmas especially uh doing some more stuff um i'm gonna i'm gonna have to, to really cut back on my spending on books but uh, i've got an idea of, of something i kind of want to do um, i'm real big into going to flea markets and and you know garage sales stuff like that so um I have an idea to, to call it the uh, like the flea market flex kind of show you guys what I've been picking up here and there and I've actually got a video for that but today is not that video today is a very special video I have um, some mystery boxes and I also have a very special AOK -okay from uh, my buddy Stevie B who um, you guys all know Stevie B um, if you don't you're missing out you need to go sub that guy up uh, he's and I don't know if I'm biased or what, but uh, but he uh, he's my favorite on YouTube in the community. I think because I can relate to him, kind of that um, I don't know that that grumpy old demeanor. I guess I I, I can relate to that. So, uh, but I just absolutely love Steve. I think he's he's just a tremendous guy, and uh, he and, and and Amy are just wonderful people. I love him to death. And uh, he has given me a Christmas a okay, and that's actually I think I'm going to start with this. Now, that's a monster right there. It's got a note on the front, so I'm going to read the note. And I haven't looked at this. And this, I got this this morning about six o'clock. Um, so actually, probably by the time I'm able to post this, this will be the following day. But I went and uh, he called me, let me know he had something for me. I went in uh, on the way to work and, and got this. And so it's been sitting, and I've been absolutely dying. So. Uh, here, I'm going to go ahead and read the note, and we'll get started into this. It says, Preacher, Merry Christmas, my friend. How cool is it to share a friend anniversary this this close to Christmas? That's true. Um, Stevie B and I, um, like a year ago now, um, you know, of course, I'd, I'd gone in his store all, pretty much every day. I can't pass it without stopping in it. But uh, it, was, it was around this time last year that, that I went in, and he had free comic books, and he asked me, he's like, hey, man, do you have, have uh, kids that like comic books? And I'm like, well, no, I don't have any kids, but I love comic books. And I had just just started um, to collect again, and uh, he had a box and had some really good stuff in it. And, and I, I he kind of let me go through it, and I got what I wanted, and um, we've been buddies ever since. And that's, I mean, he's the reason I have this YouTube video. So, or this YouTube channel. So, um, you can thank Stevie B for that. But it says, I'm looking forward to see how the preacher and Stevie B season two turns out. You've been an amazing friend to me over the last year, and I can't even begin to put into words how much that means to me. Here's to a new year, new adventures, and a shiny new wall uh, wall decoration. A PhD. Hopefully, it won't be this year, bud. But hopefully, soon I'll I'll have it. It says, I have faith that you will achieve that PhD status. Until then, maybe I can pr provide you with a few placeholders to fill in until you get it. Much love and respect, Steve. P.S. White box first, then bubble wrap. Alrighty. So, I'm going to go ahead and dive into this. Get the note off of here. I'm sentimental like that. I save stuff like this. So, set that to the side here. And uh, the uh, Tweety Bird and Sylvester wrapping paper. I am sure that Miss Amy had her hand in that. Alrighty. Now let's see the best way to get into this thing. We got this sealed up really good. Be patient with me here, guys. Here we go. Alright. 
So he said white box first, then the bubble wrap. All right, so I left the bubble wrap in the box there. We're going to the white box. Merry Christmas, preacher. Much love and respect, Steve. Man, I get so excited with these, you're, you have no idea. Alrighty. Did I not get all the tape? There we go. Alright. Alright, so I got two things in the bubble wrap. So, if you didn't know, we had uh, Steve and Comic Fu and uh, Squatchy, they had their, their Mystery Men auction, and I, uh, I bid on some books, and the, I'll go ahead and show you my winnings here, but it says, your auction wins are on the house, my brother. So he didn't even make me pay for that. That's, that's pretty awesome there. And... Uh, the Amazing Spider-Man, or Amazing Fantasy 15, uh, the facsimile reprint, love that. And then you guys know if you watch a channel, I collect uh, a lot of the black suited Spider-Man stuff. I'm trying to put together a pretty good uh, collection of that. So I bid on the Web of Spider-Man 28. And Peter Parker, the Spectacular Spider-Man 122, which actually will complete that run for me. And then Spider-Man number 20, Revenge of the Sinister Six, part 3. And The Amazing Spider-Man number 203. And I just absolutely love that cover there. That's awesome. All right, so those are my, my auction winnings, and I am happy to have those. I'm going to set those here, and then... This says, these are my gift to you for being an amazing friend. Merry Christmas. Oh, man. Okay. Let's see here. He's got, on this, this is a top loader here. Oh, wow. Evil Ernie, Volume uh, Volume Three, Number One, Issue Number One, the Stuart Sager variant. Oh my gosh, Steve, that is awesome! Check that out. And I love Evil Ernie. I've got several of the Number Ones um, of the Evil Ernies. That's awesome. I don't have that at all. That's definitely going to go on my wall back here. I love that. Set that here to the side. Oh, sweet. Oh, wow. The Avengers. This is uh, number 48. The first white She-Hulk. That's pretty awesome. Stevie B. That is ridiculous. I love that. And... Just looks like a... Carnage print... That's sick, though. Look at that. I have to get some more background on that. That is awesome. You gotta love that. If you know me, I love the symbiotes. That's definite favorite. Oh, wow. That is so cool. Thank you, Steve. And then this one. He's got sandwiched between two boards here. Get the tape off. No way. Holy crap, Steve. No way. Check that out. Wolverine number one. That is in banger shape, too. Wow. That's his first ongoing solo. Wow. Holy crap. Yeah, that's definitely going on the wall. Oh my gosh, Steve, that is awesome. <laughs> Thank you so much. Holy cow. Man. Man, and there's still more. All right. So he 
it says do the bubble wrap last. All right. What do we got here? Oh, wow. Teen Titans number 12. That's a 9.4 PGX certified. Holy crap, Steve. Holy crap, look at that. That is unbelievable. That's the first full appearance of the Batman Who Laughs. Holy cow, 9.4. See, and I don't have, I only actually only have one graded comic, and it's right there, the Venom. Um, holy cow, that's awesome, Steve. I don't know what to say, man. This is, that's unbelievable. All right. No way. Holy crap, Steve. No. Incredible Hulk 377. 9.4 rated. Look at that. That is awesome. Now, I have just a, a raw one right here, but this is like a million times better. Holy crap. 9.4. This is the, the first Professor Hulk. This is when Banner and the Hulk merge. Holy cow, Steve. Buddy, I don't deserve this. I'm my cup runneth over, man. I appreciate it so much. That is unreal. Holy cow! I don't even know what to say. Thank you, dude. Uh, I appreciate it, man. And then more than the books, I appreciate your friendship, dude. Uh, th thank you so much, man. Man, I kind of got to catch my breath here. That's awesome. That is is fantastic, Steve. I, I appreciate it more than you know. That's just unbelievable. Holy cow. That kind of makes my Christmas present to you. It puts it to shame, dude. You outdid yourself, my friend. Dude, that is wonderful. Thank you so much. So now I've got three mystery boxes to go through, and I know this is going to be a longer video. But these are from my friend Ryan Boone. Um, and he's another local guy, uh, him and, uh, CVB are friends. We, and we, you know, we all know each other and everything. And he hit me up on Instagram, said he had some mystery boxes. I have always done right by him. He's always done just amazing, amazing boxes. So I actually picked up three. So we're going to run through these right quick. And I know he said, he told me that in, uh, some of these, he's, he had a, had gotten a really good deal on uh, some X Factor. Um, oh, the I just number ran off my head. Uh, first appearance of Apocalypse, um, right here. And so he said he'd gotten a deal on some, so he put some in some of these mystery boxes. And uh, so I'm hoping to to get one of those. And he always does good Gemini mailer. So. It's a, it's a start here. Oh, cool. Already right out of the bag. Clandestine number one. Check that out. That's awesome. Conan the Barbarian number one. Conan is actually one of my favorite characters. I've got a lot of the older, like, uh, original... Conan's I got at a used bookstore. Oh, wow. Wolverine and the Punisher, number one. It's the Marvel Knights. Dude, that is sick. We got a trend going here of number one issues. All right. We broke the trend, but that's still a sweet book. Uh, Daredevil 608 and Matt Murdock versus Matt uh, Murdock. That's pretty cool. I'm I've never been a big Daredevil collector, but I've gotten some some of his stuff here recently that I'm actually digging the character. I think I might might get into that. Oh sweet, Night Thrasher number one, the first kick butt issue. Check out that get that foil there. Actually, that might be chromium. No, that's foil. That's awesome. 
Oh, cool. Domino number one, variant edition. Dude, Ryan, this has been a banger of a box, dude. That's awesome. Dark Hawk number 25. And he was... Uh, back in the day, I loved Dark Hawk. Man, check that out. That is some 90s goodness right there. Love it. Alright. Marvel Comics Group, the Cosmic Ghost Rider number one variant edition. Love some Ghost Rider. Man, all of these are awesome. And this is Wolverine number three. The variant cover, the Omega Red variant. That is sweet. That is sweet. All right, and this is Dark Knight's Death Metal. And I can't see what number it is. Number six. That's a pretty sweet cover, too. Check that out. That is a sweet box. Honestly, that one is going to be tough to beat, Ryan. So let's see what you got in this next one. I know it's a long video. I'm trying to trying to go fast here. Same Gemini mailer. Now. And it says start here. Alright, X-Men 2099, issue number one. That's awesome. Yeah, I love that. And Fantastic Four number 32. Fantastic Four number 33. Fantastic Four, number 34. I see a run going on here. Fantastic Four, number 35. I'll be honest, I don't know a whole lot. I've never been a super fan of the Fantastic Four. Um, but this is a pretty good run. Uh, Thirty, The Fantastic Four, number 36. So as far as sitting down and reading comics, I love that, that I have, have a run to go to. Number 37. All right, this is DC's Countdown number 50. Uh, check that Joker cover out. That is sick. I love that. The Joker is my all-time favorite villain. It would have just been so much better if he would have been Marvel, you know what I mean? Oh, sweet. Thor number 14. And this is a variant edition. Check that cover out. That is just absolutely nasty. I love that. That is awesome. And this is Robin 2, Joker's Wild, number one. It's got the foil in here. I don't know if you can see that. That's pretty cool. I love this series, too. All right. Oh, we got a certificate of authenticity here. This is Batman 75, City of Bane. Uh, and it's signed by Tom Kins. And this is the Del Auto cover. Oh, that's nice. Check that out. That is sweet. I love that. That cover is nasty. Okay, that's another banger box, dude. That's more than I could have hoped for. All right, last one. I know we're, we're almost to the 20 minute mark, so I'm going to hurry. Start here. The New 52 Futures in Suicide Squad number one. 
That's awesome. Dude, I love getting these number one issues. That's that's what I look for when I go go hunting. All right. Simon Dark, the grotesque guardian of Gotham City. It says number three. I've never seen this before. That is pretty sick, though. Check that out. Excuse me. All right. Oh, sweet. Absolute Carnage number five. Love the symbiotes. That is awesome. All right. Edge of the Venom verse number one. Oh, that is sweet. Check that out. That is absolutely awesome. I dig that. That's right in my wheelhouse there. All right. Ghost Rider and Blaze Spirits of Vengeance Venom. Number six. Love it. Love that. Anything Venom, anything Symbiotes, I am all about it. All right, Action Comics number 1000, the landmark issue. People tell me I have an uncanny resemblance to Superman. That's not true. Nobody's ever said that. Oh, wow. Weapon X, and this is Weapon H meets his maker. That is awesome. I absolutely love this series. All right. Oh, sweet. And this is uh, DC Rebirth, um, Action Comics, 987, The Oz Effect Part 1. Oh, that's cool. I don't know if you can see that when I move that. That's sweet. I dig that cover. That is awesome. All right. Old Man Hawkeye, number one. That is sweet. Is that the variant? Yep. Variant edition. Ryan, that is awesome, dude. All right, last one. It is X-Men number 15, the variant edition. That's pretty cool. I love that Magneto cover. That is pretty sweet. All right. That does it. I know this is a long video. Um, once again, um, if you get a chance, you uh, find Ryan Boone on Instagram. He's working. He's, he's having a little, a few issues with eBay, getting his store up, but he does awesome boxes. Um, and I'm not just saying that because I, I actually know the guy, but, um, I mean, you, the, the proof is in the pudding here. Um, so, um, when he gets that up, check him out. He's on Instagram now. Get one of his boxes. They're always quality. They're always good. Um, and Stevie B brother thank you so much um from the bottom of my heart dude i mean it um you guys my cup runneth over if i don't put out another video before have a merry christmas a happy new year and we will see you soon god bless you guys